No, it's all right. I'll give him permission. <laughs> Stay there for me. Oh. Haven't done your bit yet. Oh. I won't be one second. You're going to end up dangerously dehydrated. <laughs> Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Paula, and the registrars overseeing the ceremony today are my colleagues Heather and Lorraine. And it's a very great pleasure to welcome you all here today to the Kingscroft Hotel on this very special occasion for Dan and Lauren who are shortly to be joined together in marriage, confirming their love and commitment for one another. You are the people they have chosen to share this day with, and we know how much it means for them for you all to be here. Now, before this ceremony can begin, there is a very important question I must ask. Who gives Lauren to be married to Daniel? I do. Thank you, Mum. Mum, if you'd like to take a seat, ladies and gentlemen, if you'd like to be seated. It's always good when you hold hands without me telling you to. It tells me at least that you have met each other before. If you haven't, this is Daniel, this is Lauren. There we go, we'll just give everybody a second or two just to get something landed. There we go there. I think we're just about all safely landed there. This place in which we are now met has been duly sanctioned according to law for the celebration of marriages. We are here to witness the joining in matrimony of Daniel Anthony Wood and Lauren Jessica Lavelle. If any person present knows of any lawful reason why they may not be married to each other, you should declare it now. <laughs> I could hear a distant noise out there, but if they're under five, it doesn't count. So you're all right. So Daniel and Lauren have found in each other happiness, fulfillment and love. And as a consequence of this, they now wish to affirm their relationship and to offer to each other the security which comes from legally binding vows, sincerely made and faithfully kept. The purpose of marriage is that you may always love, care for and support each other through the joys and sorrows of life. Marriage means making a commitment for life to developing and maintaining cooperation, friendship and mutual respect. It calls for trust, understanding and encouragement. So before you are joined in matrimony, I have to remind you of the solemn and binding character of the vows you're about to make. Marriage in this country means the union of two people voluntarily entered into for life to the exclusion of all others. These vows will unite you as husband and wife and they constitute a formal and public pledge of your love for each other. So I'm going to ask each of you in turn to declare that you know of no reason why you should not be lawfully married to each other. Okay, 
So I'm going to come to you first, remember yeah. Daniel? Yeah, that's right. So I've got a question for you. The answer I'm looking for is I am. Are you, Daniel Anthony Wood, free lawfully to marry Lauren Jessica Lavelle? I am. Lovely. Now I've got the same question. I'm hoping I'm going to get the same answer. <laughs> yeah. I am. Are you, Lauren Jessica Lavelle, free lawfully to marry Daniel Anthony Wood? I am. Perfect. So you've chosen to make promises to one another as well. So I've got some more questions for you. And this time the answer is I will. Nice and short. So Dan, will you love and respect Lauren, comfort and care for her at all times? I will. Will you be honest with her and faithful and work with her to achieve the life you have planned together? I will. Lovely. He's good at these short answers, isn't he? Stop, I am. Are you ready? Lauren, will you love and respect Daniel, comfort and care for him at all times? I will. Will you be honest with him and faithful and work with him to achieve the life you have planned together? I will. Perfect responses there. So now the solemn moment has come for Daniel and Lauren to make their marriage contract with each other in the presence of you, their witnesses. So with the guests who are able, please stand to witness the contract of marriage. Now we're doing quite well, holding one hand. We're going to go for both hands now because I'm going to get you to turn and face each other. Now this is the point where you forget about everybody else in the room because you're just talking to each other now. So Daniel, you're going to go first. So if you repeat after me, but you're saying these words to Lauren. I call upon. I call upon. These persons here present. These persons here present. To witness. To witness that I, Daniel Anthony Wood, that I, Daniel Anthony Wood, do take thee, Lauren Jessica Lavelle, do take thee, Lauren Jessica Lavelle, to be my lawful wedded wife, to be my lawful wedded wife. From this day forward, from this day forward, I promise to share my life with you. I promise to share my life with you. To laugh with you. To laugh with you. To be proud of you. To be proud of you. Never take you for granted. Never take you for granted. Always take care of you, take care of you. And, be faithful to you. and be faithful to you. And I promise to love you for the rest of my life. I promise to love you for the rest of my life. Well done, that was perfect. No yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's your turn, Lauren. So repeating after me, but saying these words to you. I call upon. I call upon these persons here present, these persons here present to witness. To witness that I, Lauren Jessica Lavelle, I, Lauren Jessica Lavelle do, take thee, Daniel Anthony Wood, do take thee, Daniel Anthony Wood, to be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. From, this day forward, From this day forward, I promise to share my life with you, to laugh with you, to be proud of you, never take you for granted. Always take care of you, Always take care of you. And, be and be faithful to you. And I promise to love you for the rest of my life. Ladies and gentlemen, I think that deserves a round of applause. <laughs> yeah. Thank you if you don't like to be seated. Now then, we're nearly there. We've just got the small matter of the, ju matter of the jewelry now. So. That's it. You give him a wipe on his jacket yeah. if you want. It's red, so you're all right. <laughs> Are you okay? Do you want a tissue? No, you're right. So now we come to the giving and the receiving of the wedding rings, which is the traditional way of sealing the marriage contract. The wedding ring is an unbroken circle. It has no beginning and no end. It symbolizes everlasting love, and it's an outward symbol of the lifelong promises you've just made to each other. So Dale, have we got two rings? <laughs> I, think, I think we've had them in every single pocket combination over the last hour or so. Now, can you remember which ring comes first? Yep. Oh, he's doing well. That's it, hand that to your crew. That's all right, teamwork makes the dream work. So it goes onto the third finger there. Just hold it about halfway on. Have we got it the right way up, Lauren? Yeah. Perfect. So just holding it there as you repeat after me. 
All that I have. All that I have. I share with you. I share with you. All that I am. All that I am. I give to you. I give to you. In love and in trust. In love and in trust. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a sign of my love. As a sign of my love. And as a lasting reminder. And as a lasting reminder. Of the promises we have made of today. The promises we have made today. Well, we've just got to see if it fits now. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. That's a perfect fit. Have we got ring number two there? We have indeed. That's lovely. You can start yes. thinking about your speech now, Dale. Yeah. <laughs> no pressure. No pressure. And there we go. We're in position with that one there. So hold it there and you repeat after me. All that I have, All that I, have. I share with you. I share with all that I am, I give to you in love and in trust. I give you this ring as a sign of my love and as a lasting reminder of the promises we have made today. Let's see if this one fits as well then. That's it, give it a wiggle. It's all right, it's perfectly normal for your finger to go blue for the first yeah, couple of days. It should be all right. Daniel and Lauren, the rings you have exchanged are symbols of the commitment and care that you have promised to each other. You are also promising to share strength, responsibility and love with one another. Love is the most incredible of all our experiences that touch our lives. It creates for us the world that we want to live in. From the beginning of our lives, we know that love is the power that comforts and protects us. It is the one feeling that we can depend upon to help us through life's ups and downs. Today, as the two of you have joined together and committed your love to one another, remember the lessons of love that you've always known. Let your love comfort, support and encourage you. Let your love be the best part of your lives and always know it will make everything better and it will make your world a place of happiness. So this is the start of a new life for you together and we hope that the feelings of love and joy that you share now will deepen and grow even stronger throughout the years to come and that this day will form a milestone in your lives to look back upon with much love and happiness. You've both made the declarations required by law and you've made your own solemn promises to one another in my presence and in the presence of your family and friends gathered here today as witnesses. You've symbolised your marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and the receiving of rings. And it now gives me very great pleasure to declare you are lawfully joined together as husband and wife. And you know what comes out of it. You may kiss your beautiful bride.